Good morning, SK. My name is Clark Stewart. And I am Naomi LaSalle. Welcome to Classy Friday. So if you're not dressed to impress, then go home. Whoa, whoa, whoa. That is no way to talk to an audience. I don't take advice from a lowlife like you. ASB general elections are approaching. Election packets will be available at the ASB office starting April 8th. Juniors, the state science testing will start when you return from break. You'll be receiving a pass with your exact date and time for your session. See the library for the schedule of events by last name. Also, John Paul Jones Masonic Lodge will be available, is an available scholarship for juniors only. The deadline to submit applications will be next Sunday. Two letters of recommendation are needed to apply. Yearbooks are still for sale for $65. There are only 350 left. Order yours from the ASB office before they sell out. Me, personally, I spend my time in stocks, but let's take a look at Froyo. School can be a lot to handle. Sometimes all you need is a quick pick-me-up. For us at South, we have access to SK Latte and Lobo Froyo student store. Interactions may be short, but there's a lot that goes on behind the scenes. Have you ever wondered what it would be like to work in store operations? We dug a little deeper and spoke with the teacher of the class to find out more. Students learn a variety of skills from stocking inventory to ordering inventory, managing the inventory, selling the products to our customers um, who are the students and staff of the school. Over in SK Latte, they learn some more specific skills, how to make coffee, smoothies, spritzers, etc. Uh, they also manage the money. So after each uh, lunch, each student reconciles their cash register and makes a deposit. Store operations is a great class where students learn a lot. Let's hear from them on how their experiences have been. I really like the skill set that you learn because it's done in an environment that's really fun and very forgiving. Um, and it's just a great place to, to just work with your friends. Um, I think it's been a great experience. I think I've learned a lot and I've made a lot of friends from it. Oh, it was pretty fun. Yeah, I, I like uh, talking with the other students, um, talking with peers. With the new schedule change, bringing four lunches to three, it definitely made an impact on how the store operates. Well, it was a little chaotic at first because change is hard. And in the store operations class, we had um, a structure that kids were used to and liked. So when we changed schedules, it was a little chaotic. It was organized chaos at the beginning. But as soon as the students kind of understood the new structure of the class, they seemed to like it now and were uh, operating smoothly. Yeah, so the lunch change has definitely been a learning curve for sure, but I think that we're managing just fine so far. Even with the chaos, the students are still keeping a positive environment. Um, I'd say that we really do put effort into what we do and we really care about the customers. So when you're going to the store, it's not just that we're part of some class, it's that we actually care about the customer. I'd like people to know that the store really values you as a customer and that you should shop at SK Deca. As you can see, there's a lot being put into these operations. So don't be shy and give the latte stand and the Deca store a try. Man, I really want some Froyo now, but I can't go out looking like this. ASB is collecting blankets th all throughout March to donate. The blankets will be collected in boxes at the library. There are boxes that correspond with each class and the class with the most donations at the end of March will receive a prize. Don't miss out. Seniors, have you checked the scholarship board lately? There is over $34,000 available from the Port Orchard Rotary. Apply now to get free money. Have you bought your Tolo tickets yet? If you want them at their cheapest, you need to buy them today. Prices go up by $2 on Monday. In the schedule of events, dance is competing at State today over in Yakima. Tennis is facing Bethel with JV defending the home court. Fast pitch will also face Bethel with varsity staying at home. Tomorrow, C-Team Baseball will face Olympia here at home. Last night, soccer faced Olympia. Varsity put up a tough fight, but ultimately lost in penalties, 2-1. to one. Durr scored with two minutes left to tie it and sent it to penalty kicks. Kirby stood tall at the goal, but team, the team ultimately fell. JV and C-Team had a rough night on the pitch and gave their best, but both teams also lost. Seniors, the end of the year is approaching. You may be getting tons of letters from colleges. Some of these letters made from baby from colleges you never knew of. 
Hello. How can I help you today? Hi. I'd like to cancel my mail at Newman University. Certainly. How long would you like to cancel it for? No. I don't think you get me. I want out. Permanently. I'll handle this, Violet. Why don't you take your three-hour break? <clears throat> Calm down, everyone. No one is canceling any mail. Oh, yes, I am. Well, what about our special Newman scholarships? They can't pay for the college I'm going to. Right. Well, what about on-campus events? I mean, five months ago, you were interested in Newman University. I'm not going to Newman University. I don't want to hear anything else from you guys. No more cars, no more letters. No more emails, telephones, fax machines, Delix, FedEx, telegrams, holograms. Stop mailing me about Newman University. I'm tired of seeing it. My friends on Instagram send me memes. My family at Thanksgiving tells me about Newman. I was at the post office, right? And my mailbox was filled to the brim. And all of the letters in my box were stamped with the same message. Become a new man at Newman University. Well, I'm not going to Newman University. I don't want to be a new man at Newman University. I don't want it. All right, it's true. Of course no one needs our mail. You think you're so clever figuring that out? But you don't know the half of what goes on here. So just walk away. I beg of you. Is everything all right here, Postal Employee Wilson? Mm. Yes, sir. We're just getting everything squared away. Right, Mr. Customer? Oh, yeah. As long as I stop getting mail! It's okay to decline. But you have to let them know. It may even open up a slot for someone else. On the topic of colleges, Bates Technical College will be hosting an open house. If you'd like to go see the programs available to you after graduation, stop by the Career Center to pick up a field trip permission form. Forms are due by next Friday. In clubs, World Builders will now be meeting on Tuesdays starting next week. Speech and debate will not meet until after break. The first meeting will be April 11th, and they'll meet every other week for the rest of the year. The clubs meeting today are AAPI and Builders of Unity. Meeting tomorrow will be International and Magic the Gathering. Now with that, I'm ready to take this thing off. Yeah, all my wealth is melting from the studio lights. Wait, I think we're still alive. What? What?